Hello everyone, my name is Stephen Beach. I'm a careers advisor with the National Careers Service and I'm here to give you some advice about transferable skills. So, what do we mean by transferable skills? Well, these are personal qualities that can be transferred from one job to another. As the labour market changes, you may need to think differently about the types of roles that are now available. It's likely that you already possess many transferable skills that are desirable to employers, even if you don't have direct experience in that particular role. This video will help you organise these skills and recognise them and give you practical examples of how they could also be used in a job. Let me give some practical examples of how you may have gained some transferable skills beneficial to potential employers through your everyday life. People skills are essential for many different types of jobs. So experience you've gained in one job, like working in a bar or a cafe, it could be a great way to get into a job in retail or customer service. Organisation and planning are key skills used for a variety of job roles. If you're a parent, for example, you'll be juggling many tasks and the needs of your children on a daily basis. Without realising it, you finally tuned your organisation and planning skills. How about negotiation skills? Perhaps you've negotiated a better deal with your electricity supplier or a good price when purchasing a car. These are examples of negotiation skills, which are valuable in many different roles, particularly those involving sales and management. And don't forget communication skills. Being able to get your point across in calls or emails, they are important in most job roles. So it's important to show that you can communicate effectively. Hobbies, interests or any other voluntary work you might do can also help you build the skills you need for potential employers. For example, you may belong to or manage a football team. Through these types of activities, you will have gained teamwork and communication skills, working together to meet challenges to work under pressure. We all have achievements, and achievements doesn't have to mean trophies or certificates. Maybe you have set up an event and organised something, built a computer, sold a product online. These are all skills that are beneficial to potential employers and will help you find work. It's a good idea to make a list of the skills you have that might help you and don't forget to think about the skills you've got from outside of work. So how do you match your transferable skills to job applications? Start by taking a look at the description of the job you want to apply for. It will tell you what the skills and experience they require from you. Highlight the main points and match these skills and experiences you have. I hope you have found this video useful. We have a range of online tools at the National Career Service to help you identify your skills and match them to jobs that might suit you. If you are looking for any further advice, visit gov.uk forward slash job help, which has lots of job search ideas and advice and links to latest vacancies.